from the last season, and I think it uh, will be a very tough game. Uh, I think uh, when you play against a team like Manchester City, always uh, you must to give your best uh, to to try to get the three points. I think it's, that is our challenge. But I think it's too early to start to talk uh, about uh, decisive. Uh, games or decisive point to get uh, uh, to to try on the end to achieve big things. I think it's too early. It's a lot of game ahead still. I think for me he's uh, one of the best managers in the world, and uh, but it's normal. Uh, the English football in the last uh, few years. Uh, increase a lot the, the, the level and uh, always difficult to arrive in a new club, uh, change philosophy, settle your value, your principle. But uh, he's doing very well. And I think uh, they are uh, only, we are in the top six very, very close altogether. I think we are in, in the similar situation. And um, I'm sure that on the end, uh, he will success uh, because he's a great, a great manager. You said after the last game that Potter was really keen to outplay Manchester City at that point of the season. In time, that with 4 0 defeat last week, do you have an edge going into this game? I think always for me and for us, uh, we try to take uh, all the games. Um, don't don't think what happened in the past. I seen the always uh, every game is a different world. It's different. It's complete different. Different emotion. Uh, it's sure that uh, they are not happy with the last week, and and they will try to to show and play in front of the supporters and the fans and and try to change the the history and try to change the the feeling that they, they got against Everton. And it's not a reference before, it's not a reference our game on Wacker Lane. It's a completely different uh, period, completely different, will be all different. And it's for that for us is to be focused in try to develop our game in, in the best way. Uh, to try uh, to show that we can be the real contender for, for the Premier League. That is for us the most important challenge. More, it's more important to show ourselves that we can be a, con a real contender that uh, that uh, that uh, on the end to show Manchester City. I think that we need to show ourselves that we are capable to to deal with that pressure that and and, and try to to win games uh, on the end to to achieve big things. You know, I have full respect for everyone and every single opinion. Uh, nothing to comment. I think uh, everyone can uh, make uh, they, they comment, and uh, it's sure in football nobody have the the true, or everyone have they true. Of course, we have our true, and. Uh, it's for that I think it's important for me to be to show respect to everyone and everyone that can uh, can uh, give their opinion always is important. But I think it's not uh, for me to comment the opinion that in that case uh, was from from him. Oh, Shan is uh, it's okay. It's very positive. Uh, we are pushing him a lot. Uh, after a few days. Uh, it's always uh, spend the same time than us, 12 hours on the on the on the on the training ground. It's a little bit boring to see him, but uh, now nah, I think it's it's okay. It's good. Uh, we expect uh, this week less than that in the first moment uh, was uh, our idea. Uh, I don't want to put okay or to settle the the limit or the time. But I think it's very positive, and you know, when your mind is is, is okay, it's good, it's positive. Always you can recover uh, early from your uh, injury. No, no, no. Uh, 
No, it's a, it's a similar, but nothing uh, to do with with the old injury that he he suffered on the Euros. Um, it's, it's, it's different, and it's, it's maybe similar, but the good thing that uh, yes, uh, in the first moment looks bad, really bad, but this is when we ass, uh, assess him and the doctor and the, the scanner uh, show that uh, it's not how uh, we think. Uh, from the from the beginning. Yes, of course. We have plenty of players that can uh, performance in his place, and uh, no, uh, we are very happy with the squad and with the player that we have. Uh, um, we don't need another. Ah, but do you know me and. Uh, and do you know better than me uh, that the rumors is, is impossible to stop the rumors and and um, like always <laughs> I think nothing to comment about about the rumors. No? The only I, I can say is is we are not uh, looking for to replace or to add some player in in that area of the of the of the team. No, only Tom Carroll, that you know. He moved uh, uh, to to Swansea, but we not expect another another uh, another move. I understand that sometimes when you are in some position, you need to find uh, uh, to try to find ideas. Uh, <laughs> but I don't want to imagine without outside to play. It's like to play single with Marriott, no? Yeah. Like uh, when we play sometimes without rules. I don't know. I think uh, be careful with that. Uh, it's true that I I, I really. Only I, I read some uh, um, s sentences, but uh, but I don't know. Uh, my first impression is uh, I think be careful uh, because uh, the, in football uh, to start to talk about to change the rules is, is very difficult thing. It's, it's true that it's not perfect uh, sport, but it's nearly perfect. And um, I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. And because it's a different thing that uh, maybe to improve uh, our sport and to and to try to to do football more exciting. But I think it's exciting. I'm seeing the fans uh, and the player and and the professional uh, staff or coaches. Um, I think it's a it's a big a massive uh, de debate debate in the future, but uh, I don't know. To me, uh, when I hear that, it's only can smile a little bit, but difficult to think that can be possible. Okay, we take a question over here. Yes. Yes, I know. I know very, very well him because uh, uh, I saw him w uh, play uh, in, on, in his national team in Brazil. I think he's not a, a, a properly striker. It's more a he's a player that can play like a second striker. Uh, okay, but um, you know, he's very young. I think he's a very potential or very talented uh, player. Uh, maybe will be on the on the pitch or, or on the bench. I don't know, but in my opinion, he's he's, he's very young. He's 19 year old, um, and uh, he's, uh, we need to wait. No, uh, but uh, yes, maybe he can play. But we know very well. Uh, you know, today it's too difficult uh, not uh, be. Uh, he, um, 
or have idea because today with uh, with internet, with games, uh, watching football for everywhere, and I think you can find information quick. Okay, Jerry. No, 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 no. No, maybe, maybe I, I, I confuse you, but no, we are not looking to to add player in that uh, transfer market. Okay, let's take a question here. Sorry? Did you get to know Pep Guardiola during your time when you played against each other in Spain? CK? Yes, I know very well. Do you have a, a close relationship? Do you speak with him regularly? No, no close relationship. I know very well because I think we we play during four years, uh, every season we play uh, sometimes Copa del Rey again, uh, sometimes, okay, of, of course in, in La Liga, maybe we play ten times. Again, uh, I know very well. And then Barcelona is not too big like London. Eh? You you can uh, meet uh, some someone uh, easy. And yes, but I know very well. We have uh, he have uh, in his staff uh, a very good people, very good friend of mine. Uh, yes, we know each other very very well. We play against and. You know, we spent time twenty. I spent twenty more than twenty years on Barcelona, and and he born uh, close to Barcelona, not in Barcelona, but close to Barcelona, and, and he spent his life like a, a player in Barcelona. Yes. Okay, Kerry. Uh, I am fat than before, <laughs> than four years. I was younger than today. I changed a lot. Uh, yes, I think uh, how the, the the new lifestyle on on, on England changed. You no, know, myself. Now I think that was a it's an amazing time for me. I I learned a lot. I I think I um, for me it's it's how develop develop myself. How the the, to know the new culture, the new language, how uh, was a massive, massive step for me, uh, personal and professional, and uh, I am very thankful, thankful, thankful uh, to England, to the Premier League, to the people here because uh, I think you you help a lot. To, to improve myself and, and learn a lot. I think that uh, for me it was a, a big step uh, forward in my career and personality too. You say you can't stop the rumours. Nigel Kuning, who are made of player, and Spain, who are made of players. Do you have an ambition to be a great England manager like Sir Alex Ferguson, a man who you refer to regularly as you came here to Tottenham and aspire to win trophies? If my ambition is to be one day. A great England manager. A great manager in England. Yeah. A great manager in England, no Engl English. Not, Engl not England. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yes, I am very happy uh, here. It's true that uh, yes, my uh, we are we adapt ourselves, me and my staff, very well here. Uh, I think it was fantastic uh, after a a good, a not so good uh, experience in in Spain, like a coach. And I think that uh, we fit from the day one uh, fantastic uh, on England. And it's true that uh, it's only four years here, but it uh, looks that maybe we are here from 20 years. No? And, uh, and um, that is fantastic. Uh, why not? It's true that I am not a person that uh, thinking in 10 years ahead. Uh, we try to enjoy today. and. Uh, to try to look after or, or do your thing to try for tomorrow to be better. And, uh, and look, uh, with that philosophy, in the moment we spent for so far four years here. And it uh, will be fantastic to spend more time. OK, Chris. Yes, it will be a fantastic achievement. Uh, I will sure, I feel, 
I, I will feel uh, more proud than our player because they deserve the full credit in in all that is happened here. Uh, I think it will be fantastic. Uh, it's true that uh, we need to think in in a big thing in a big things uh, because I think Tottenham deserve for history and because we have an amazing uh, fans in behind and uh, I think this season was a fantastic opportunity to to show uh, to show me ourselves and and the people outside not only in England outside to England uh, ninety thousand nearly nineteen thousand people. Uh, and one Wembley to play in Champions League. That was an amazing thing. And um, I think this is that. It's, now it's, it's too difficult uh, to be patient, to arrive uh, and compete for big things. But it's true that we start very, very off from the bottom to build a new philosophy, culture. And, um, and it's true. Now we are in a very good uh, way. And our objective and our challenge is to fight for big, big things. Uh, but it's sure that it's important now to keep, uh, will be important, but it's in the same level uh, to show, like I, I told you, to try to show ourselves that we can fight or we are in the way that we can achieve in the future big things. Yes. No, I think it was a great experience. It was a fantastic idea from from Daniel and and the board uh, that, that 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 season to 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 play in Wembley and to feel uh, what what happened there. And uh, for me, it was a fantastic experience. Nothing to to do with with Wembley. I think our our player now they know what uh, what means compete on Wembley, and uh, it should that for me myself. To learn and, and of course and to feel and to feel the same, no, uh, to to got that feeling. We have uh, ahead uh, unbelievable opportunity to play Europa League, and uh, I think we will arrive in a fant fantastic condition uh, to play on Wembley the whole season and uh, to make uh, Wembley our home. That is our our challenge. But I think it's not uh, a question mark next season or to move there. And we'll see what happened. Now we we know uh, we will uh, expect uh, from us and from and from the stadium. And uh, it's true that it's completely different to Whitehall Lane. But uh, we need to make uh, Wembley our home. And then when we will move uh, uh, to here again, is uh, will be similar stadium to to Wembley. Uh, we need to to. To adapt ourselves and compete in a big, in a big uh, scenario, big stadium, and uh, that uh, will be natural for us. Okay, I'm going to look to it. So I've got Alison, Dan, Joe down here, and then two here. Alison first. Yes. Yes, but do you know? I think be careful because only. They are three points in behind us, and they are in Champions League, and uh, they are in, in in one cup. <laughs> I think be careful and a lot of game and competition ahead. I think it's, it's normal. The expectation was massive and big, and the inversion, of course, too on summer, different to us. But I think they are. Uh, we need to be calm. I think the. Um, Always, the judgment is on the end. It's impossible now to judge uh, uh, their performance uh, on the half season, after half season. And, and because I know very well Guardiola, and, and he's, a, he's a great manager, and one of the best. And it's, you can expect uh, dif different things. Uh, it's only that, you know, when you arrive to a new club and uh, different philosophy, you need to adapt your 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 value or your principle to to a new culture. Always difficult, but I think uh, not change my opinion 
uh, from him. Okay. Alison, last one. <clears throat> No, I, I am not a person that judges another people. I, I don't put myself in front of the TV. I say, oh, what this happened and, and judge. Uh, I think, uh, you know, the expectation was massive when Guardiola signed from Manchester City. And uh, I think all, all is in that moment expect that Guardiola win the Premier League after 10 games. And that is impossible. Uh, I think only is uh, is because it's football. It's a big business, and it's normal uh, to speak, to talk. But um, I have uh, no doubt that uh, that with time he will success there. Okay. Yes, we we it's it's a uh, it's a good point because tomorrow he will do a, a um, he ha. We have a scanner there. It's still uh, difficult to to give uh, the time that can uh, come back. Uh, we need to wait tomorrow, and then we we'll see what happens. Because it's still some problems, and uh, it's not sure uh, the diagnostics. Diagnostic. 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 Yeah. And uh, we need to wait tomorrow. Yes, we are. We are now. Uh, we start to be concerned or worried. Concerned, concerned about about him because he's uh, more than uh, or nearly three months, three months, and uh, still in a situation that is is not move on. Okay. Today, nobody advise the Italian. Uh, Doctor or physio, and at the moment, uh, it's, it's, it's better to wait tomorrow the new scanner. Okay, Joe. Yes. You don't like to look too far into the future. Yes. Um, but seeing the success you've had last season and now this season, a new stadium coming in, players, contracts all figured out. Are you further ahead in this process than you thought you would have been when you took charge of something in terms of what you want to achieve? If we are. Yeah, are, you, yeah. are you further ahead? Yeah. But I don't know, but that is it's too difficult for me sh to judge because you know we are ambitious and we want to win every game, <laughs> you know. And uh, I think uh, if we go back backward first season, and if we now uh, start to see and analyze and judge, I think we are. Thousand miles ahead, but in football, no. It's uh, it's about belief. It's about uh, faith. It's about to work hard, and it's true that we move on the club in, in two year and a half, and that uh, that was uh, our uh, our uh, expectation, not to to push and move the club quick. But sometimes it's not possible. But it's true that. Now uh, we are in a very good uh, period, and I think all that related with Tottenham is exciting. You can see here, uh, you can see the, the new stadium, you can see the, the team, the squad. All that happened is, 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 is very positive, but it's true to year and a half before I arrive here, you always, when all related to Tottenham, some good, some not so good, and today is looking like uh, we are uh, the best team on the world. But that is very good. And uh, the, wo the, the hard work is to keep that, that feeling. Okay. And it will be difficult, but we will try. OK. Took one question each, OK? Who wants to go first? Go on. David Van. Yeah. Ban, in, a ban from diving. I don't know, I don't know. <laughs> what means? I don't know. It's sorry? It's, it's difficult. I was player. 
and, and, and it's difficult sometimes to to judge when the player uh, dive spreads or or dive because uh, was a uh, no good coordination and uh, it's in football it's too difficult to judge. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what I can say <laughs> now. Okay. For That's me. It's, it's better don't touch too much hmm. the rules, but you know I understand that some people around football n good to introduce new ideas, but we'll see. Okay, Alistair, last one, please. No, 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 no. I think it's, it's clear. Uh, uh, Jos is a is a potential first team player like his uh, Cameron, like his uh, Harry Wings, like his uh, all the younger that are in, in, in our in our academy. I think the best uh, way to, to improve is training with us and when and try to show that he, he deserves uh, to be involved. Uh, and in that moment it's sure that we we give the opportunity to, to play and show his quality. But uh, no, no, no. We are not thinking in in to 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 send along him. Lovely. Okay. We have the cameras off now, please. If you're part of the BPP, that will be taking place in the 1951. Johnny will signal.